everybody wanted to see that number go up. Uh, uh, Ron Paul's numbers, you know, six million dollars in one day. I mean, that's just unbelievable. Tea Party money bomb, so geez, it was kind of a no-brainer that we should do something big in Boston. Faneuil Hall is known as the cradle of liberty, so it was just the, the perfect spot to have this Boston Tea Party event. We needed um, a permit to rally on the State House steps. We needed another permit to march down the Freedom Trail. The Granny Warriors needed a permit for their uh, Winnebago. They also needed a permit for the Monkey. Ultimately, we got no permits and freedom prevailed. <laughs> Ron Paul, for him to go against the opposition that he's going against, you know, for people to, uh, you know, laugh at him, boo his ideas, and the fact that he still keeps doing what he's doing, no matter what his ideas are, I mean, that takes guts, and you recognize people with guts. See, integrity, you don't see that in anybody else. You don't see that in Giuliani. You don't see that with the Democrats. You know, if it weren't for him, I know there's so many people who wouldn't even be interested in the presidential race. So this is a revolution without bullets being fired right now. There is quite a few people in Europe that follow what Ron Paul is doing and support him and it's not, uh, we are not all socialists in Europe. One of the really appealing things about Ron Paul is that he understands the importance of history. He understands the importance of seeing where you're coming from and of not having the presumption in one generation to toss away the accumulated wisdom of ages. Today as we gather here in Faneuil Hall, we are going to set a record for fundraising. We are sending a message to the world that we won't be ignored. The establishment and their high-rise penthouse views laughs at you. They laugh at us, the Ron Paul rabble. But you know what? They're not laughing today. We reignited the torch of liberty. This is where it all began in Boston. I think we, we accomplished something great. We really did. And we had the biggest one-day fundraiser in the history of uh, online fundraising for political candidates ever. Yeah.